I'm Eddie Jackson Jr. and this is Real True Street Crime. And I'm going to give y'all some thoughts of New York because New York is going through so much hell and I'm praying for them. Let me say this about it. I slide into town. My man asked for the usually to pick me up at the check casting joint. We on our way down to Branson to get something to smoke. Now, a lot of times, the star of the show didn't come out to maybe three or four in the morning, so you might slide down there and try to get something to smoke, and you might not be able to get nothing at three or four in the morning. But however, when it's like that, and you go there, at this time, he used to be on 145 in St. Nick. He's not there anymore, and I know that. The last time I was there, he hadn't moved, so for all of you who think I don't know, I know that's my smoke, man, I know. So listen, and when he was on 145 in St. Nick, it was a little fish place right up on 145 on the corner before you got to him. It was some of the best fish and shrimp that you ever want to eat. You couldn't eat there. You just walk in. It was just a little walk-in joint to just walk up, walk down, order, and come out. Best fish and shrimps I ate in New York. And the brother there who used to run in the owner of the home, every time, Detroit! Detroit in the town! Every time I come in my little fish play. And I hope they are right because I love to get to eat some more of them fish and shrimp. I'm dying too. I miss them. So I pray for y'all at the fish place and the shrimp that y'all are right. And y'all know I pray that my brother Branson is all right and make it good through this. But let me go on to this little story. We had stopped at that little fish and shrimp joint I'm telling you about on 145 in St. Nick. Then we eaves on down to Branson. Now that would be early in the day we get the fish, but at four in the morning, that's closed. So when we ease down to Branson, cause we've been hanging out bullshit and got some smoke from somewhere else just to hold us over. So you ease down to Branson by four in the morning. The star of the show slides into the shop. You understand? And when the star of the show slides in, believe me, if you sit around and you was waiting on him to come, I have seen every major celebrity there sitting waiting. I ain't going to name them all, but I'll tell you Biggie was one, and I'll go from there. But I'll tell you this to even go one step further. I have seen every major New York rapper there except for Jay-Z. He's the only one I have never seen there. The rest of them I have seen there. So I'm going to leave it right there. And that's on 145 in St. Nick. Me and my man S. Green Eyes be hanging out talking shit. And I know Green Eyes catching hell right now. New York is the town and the city that never sleeps. I know me. The brother don't come out to two and go in to six up in the morning. Man, you talking about a deserted. I can imagine for New Yorkers. I imagine for all of y'all that y'all catching hell because I know y'all lifestyle and I know what this coronavirus has done to it. So I'm just reminiscing about times sliding around eating some of the best fish and shrimps up on 145 in St. Nick's and then sliding right on down to my man Branson getting some of the best weed you can ever smoke. That California chronic he used to keep and occasionally, that motherfucking black dot, I'm going to tell y'all right now, that black dot is some of the best weed I've ever smoked. Right alongside the wood, right up the street from Branson. And as I say, I got to give a shout out to all my brothers that I hung out with there. S number one, shoddy number two, pretty, who got the wood. Pretty was the wood man. Pretty is the one who would get the wood for us, you understand? Shorty was my man in PA. That was Sean's S-Man. That was S-Man, you understand? So the whole thing about it is I got to say farewell, and I hope, not farewell, I hope to see all of y'all soon and that you all 
are doing excellent and that your health is good. So I got to say peace and love to everybody on the East Coast. I hope y'all make it throughout this very serious coronavirus that we going through. And dearest, I hope you all right too. I pray for all of y'all. Peace and love. Just thinking about my New York crew and missing my fish and shrimps and my Branson. So this is Eddie Jackson Jr. Real True Street Crime saying to all of y'all reminiscing on my New York days. This is my ice of tea. It's a cold shake tea. Put it in a bottle of cold water. Shake it up with a little exercise that helps suppress your appetite. If you'd like to give me a play, go to my link. Go to shop. Go to categories. Go to health and wellness. It's where you'll find my alleviate cream. It helps alleviate all the pain. It's a wonderful product. It's a CBD product. This is also a CBD product. It is my Harmony Drops. Drop two under your tongue, let it sit for 60 seconds, and then swallow. It is a wonderful product. And as I say to y'all always, our thing here, and as I always say to y'all, you can go to my Facebook page and take a look at all my pictures and what I look like before and after using ISO T and working out. Our thing here is a five for five challenge. Five pounds in five days. It is a total life change and life is good. Peace and love to all New Yorkers. All the boys, be safe, stay safe, keep that coronavirus down and we got to do the same down here in Florida. So peace and love to America. And please, let's all get together and beat this coronavirus so we can get together again and have a wonderful time. Subscribe, share, and pass this along and like. Subscribe, share, and like. And thank you to everybody who goes to my link and spend anything. And thank you to everybody who takes time to listen to my story. Subscribe, share, and like. I'm out.